hello lovelies welcome back to my channel today we'll be talking about interfacing if you are just clicking in for the first time you are welcome this channel is all about fashion tutorial on bags fascinator caps mini bags we sell plain and pattern materials and many more please do well to subscribe and click on the notification bell so that you will get notified whenever we post a new video and also like and share this video when i started my sewing journey it was really confusing when using interfacing so today i will be giving guide easy guide on how to use interfacing what interfacing is and their types as well so without any more ado let's start what is interfacing Interfacing is a fabric or texture attached to the wrong side of the fabric. It can interfacing is a texture attached to the wrong side of your fabric. You put this interfacing at the wrong side of the fabric that you are using. They are mostly ironed to the wrong side of our fabric. The fabric, the wrong side of the fabric can be non-printed or the side that you want it to be hidden. Now where can we use interfacing interfacing are used to sifting up and give structure to the fabric examples are include our colors you can use an interfacing for your color or for your button holes to make the line in your button holes stay or for your bands and you can also use it for um can also use you can also use it for your fleece like your fleece skirt or your hip or your breast stop now types of interfacing there are different types of inter interfacing it's usually come in fusible eg that is to say which we can iron them on our material number one type of interfacing is st this is the most popular interfacing that we know here in my country, Nigeria, it is regularly called gum stay. Now, number two, it's paper stay. Number two is cover stay. This is generally called poplum stay. Number four is wording. This wording comes both in soft, medium, and hard. So also the air tray. The air tray comes both in hard and in light forms. Now, when do I use this? When I when do I use this? interfacing now number one place you can use interfacing is making of your process if you are making uh, your process you can put a word in the hard one or the medium one and you can also put an ashtray this ashtray will make it stay in place number two is for sipping up your peplums like your peplum blouses if you want to do your peplum blouses you put an a an interfacing so that the the peplum um the peplum blouse will stay on its own the next one is for your neck collar so you can also use interfacing for your breast and also for your hip you can also use it to reinforce your button holes one important thing that you need to know is when you are using your interfacing in your ankara it helps to give it more structure most especially if you want to do and uh, ankara hats this sunny hat or a turban or a headband if you put your interfacing in your ankara it gives it this amazing structure it makes it comes out on a different level and that is why i love using interfacing now note one of the important thing you need to know about using interfacing is that it is all it all depends on the effect you are trying to achieve you can use this kind of interfacing the air stray the paper stray the color stray and the wording you can use it on any material and any time depending on the effect you are trying to achieve i hope this video was helpful please don't forget to subscribe like and share see you next time see you on my next video springs here signing out